Welcome back. All right, we all know Stephen Curry is one of the most influential and dynamic players in the history of basketball, but a new documentary called Stephen Curry Underrated shows the remarkable coming of age story for Curry. It documents his rise from an undersized college player at a small town division one college to becoming a four time NBA champion. That's the guy we all know. So here to tell us more, we actually have the film's director and producers, Peter Nix and producer Sean Havey. Thank you both for being here. Thanks for having, Thanks us. For having us. It's very inspiring. Were you inspired by Steph before this, or how did the documentary first come about? Yeah, I mean, he, he's he's a legend. I mean, we, we've been making documentaries in the Bay Area for for quite mm. some time now, for over okay. a decade. My, my work has mainly been looking at public institutions. I made a film about Highland Hospital called The Waiting Room and mm -hmm. uh, the Oakland Police Department and Oakland High School. It's a sort of trilogy of films mm -hmm. looking at okay. community. Um, okay. And Steph Curry is sort of an institution of sorts. Uh, he's one man, sure you is. know, not just uh, known locally, but also, also sort of nationally. Yeah. And, and uh, he, he approached us. It, it was his time. He felt it was his time um, yeah. to tell his story because he was um, trying to do something that he had promised his mom. Oh, um, that he had never yes. graduated college. Never graduated right. college. I and saw so that. That, when we began were the, it. that began the process of us telling the story. Well, and you yeah. look at a, a player like Steph Curry and love him or, you know, there is no love him or hate him, really. Yeah, he, just he, love him. He, you just love him. <laughs> Even much. if he beats your team, like he kind of humanized the sport mm -hmm. of basketball for a lot of fans and then a lot of non fans. You really want to follow him and, yeah. and learn more. Mm -hmm. Like he's just a good guy, it seems like. I know. I wasn't a huge basketball fan before no. making this movie, actually. Now Pete knows I'm like a convert. I watch <laughs> really? all the games. Yeah, I'm obsessed. So. Yeah. So he kind of lived up to maybe what you hoped he would be. Mm. Absolutely. He puts the work in, you know, like we filmed a lot of workout scenes with him, um, spent a lot of time with him. Uh, Pete and I specialize in observational filmmaking, so sort of fly in the wall okay, sort of yeah. uh, approach to filmmaking. And he's as as he seems. Honestly, people always ask me, it's like, is he as nice as he seems? And it's like, yes, he is as genuine as you think he is. He's accessible, you know, and, and, yeah, I, and I think huge. that, you know, you know, we, we you know, celebrity documentaries are are, are tricky because celebrities tend mm -hmm. to be guarded, Stop, they get right. jaded, mm -hmm. they get suspicious, cynical, and he was none of those things. Mm -hmm. and, and and he's almost like an everyman sort of when you meet him. Yes. He's wow. about my height, you know, he's Always just like makes me. Eye contact. Yeah. Makes eye contact. Makes very direct with his, his eye contact. Um, and I think yeah. it's that humility that sort of draws people. Everybody mm -hmm. believes, even young mm -hmm. people, the way he change the game shooting the yes. three-pointer yeah anybody can kind of do that with enough practice and so that really um, brings people in yeah he left his stamp on the NBA his drills regardless. are just amazing the ones that you show oh yeah my where he's touching it was amazing to me though to hear the story the backstory before I only knew him once he won his first championship right but you really go back and show how he was like the little peanut out there just <laughs> trying to shoot over the tall guys right it's, it's true yeah and there wasn't a lot of because of that like because he wasn't a phenom a young phenom like some other athletes there wasn't a lot of footage so it's a uh, you it's know pre-iPhone. Oh, yeah, well, iPhone point. came out in 07, which is shocking. Oh. Right. Uh, <laughs> I didn't shoot video. Very little footage. Is it we... mostly home video that you show? Because yeah. you hear his yeah. mom's voice sometimes yes. on yeah. it, right? Exactly. Okay. Oh, it's so cute. Del yeah. had like a his father. Del had like a like a you know beta cam. The big camera yeah. on the shoulder. Yep. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What surprised cool. you the most mm. about Stephen Curry? I, well, the first time I met him. Um, he immediately started talking about his time at Davidson. He got his phone out. He was showing me mm -hmm. videos and pictures oh, from his time, proud time in college. Yeah, really nostalgic. And I, and I think for someone like Steph, you know, that that youth, that 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 um, innocence, it quickly melted away as he became a, became uh -huh. a superstar. So he has a lot of nostalgia for that. Mm -hmm. And I think yeah. the the idea of telling that story, nobody really knows that okay. story, and he had not really talked about it very much. And so. Yeah. Uh, we knew right then and there like, that that was going to be the spine yeah. of, yeah. of the Same. idea. That's what surprised you most. It, I mean, you had that camaraderie that they had of his, you know, on his college team mm -hmm. is, I mean, it just brings him back to that, like Pete was saying, that time when he could kind of just melt away and be a basketball player. Because yeah. mm -hmm. now he can't, you know, he can't walk around. Right? No, he no. just swarmed. But back then, he <laughs> was just like especially. a friend to his other his colleagues, you know, yeah. his other what players. What a fun project. It's, Congratulations. I know you guys are making the circuit with the film festival. Yes. We'll so get to see it eventually here yeah. very soon, right? Best of luck. Yes, for all of that. Meanwhile, you can see Stephen Curry underrated. It premieres on Apple TV Plus on July 21st. All right.